welcome back to my channel it's your girl trish so while i'm in this mood of like getting these videos and stuff done and getting these videos out to you guys i wanted to go ahead and show you guys like my favorite like hygiene products that i like to use when i am doing my pamper routine or just my everyday hygiene routine i did one on my channel like maybe I want to say a year and a half ago or two years ago, but um, there's some things have changed. So I wanted to show you guys like my updated products, um, the like the not updated but the new products that I like to use. Some things are still the same, and then so I do have a few other things I like to do in my pamper routine or just products I like to use in my everyday hygiene routine video. So we're going to get into that. So just starting off, um, of course. Um, for like my toothpaste and everything, I do like to use the Advanced Wipe Arm and Hammer Toothpaste. And then of course, I like to follow that up with my Listerine mouthwash. I brush my teeth twice a day, morning and nighttime. Because if not, I get like really bad gingivitis. I don't know why I have like sensitive gums, but you know, I just, that's just the uh, what I tend to do now. Just to kind of prevent that, just to keep my teeth white and clean and just keep my breath smelling good because don't nobody want no stank funky smelly breath around them so of course moving on to the tub um when i you know when i'm when i'm feeling like a little you know when, whenever i feel like doing like my little camp routine or you know i just kind of want to relax i like to do a i like to soak i like to soak and i like to take a, a bubble bath i do work um i work in the medical field i'm always on my feet i'm always whipping and running around the hospital so like after a long week i like to you know take out time for myself and i just like to soak and just chill and just like just take a moment and just relax because like i said i just work in the medical field and it's tough on your girl sometimes it's tough on the body so i like to soak so what i like to, my favorite like bubble bath that i like is this um milk bath with shea butter i always get this from walmart um, it has shea butter in it, lavender, and chamomile, and it's a foaming bath with milk protein. I really like it. You know, uh, I get a lot of bubbles. It makes my skin soft. Shea butter, and you know that's why I really like. That's what I really like to uh, soak in. And when I'm doing my little soap, I like to use my Epsom salt, y'all. And I just use the regular one. Um, this one eases aches and pains, and it's fragrance free. This is what I like to use um, when I'm doing my soap. This medical field, like I said, is tough on your girl's body. And after working a long week of cleaning people, not cleaning people, but taking care of people and doing all of that, my coins, my rolls, everything needs to just be free. I need to relax. So I really like my Epsom salt because my Epsom salt kind of just, it kind of just, eases the tension off my body and makes me feel good and it helps me relax after a long week of work and then i love doing my um my scrub and the only scrub i use is the tree hut scrub right now the one i'm using is called the vitamin c shea sugars shea sugar scrub um it's made with vitamin c and alpha hydroxy acid I don't know how they make their stuff, but I really like their scrub because it, like it's really gritty, so it like helps get like all the dead skin off, and it like it just scrubs you really, really, really good. Um, yeah, Tree Hut, Tree Hut, band hands down has like the best body scrubs. I've tried so many of different of the so many different um, I've tried so many different scents from them, and I like them all. It's just whatever I'm feeling at the time, and of course when I'm taking a shower. I love my loofah. I love my loofah because it exfoliates the skin. It helps you get all the dirt off your skin. It helps you get all the crevices. It helps you get in all those crevices and stuff. And my arms are short, you guys. So it helps get behind the back and everything. Because, you know, when you're taking a shower, you can't really reach your back and stuff. So I like using this to, like, really, like, clean my back and stuff. Because it just gets all the dirt and stuff off. And my favorite body wash is Caress. I love Caress. And I really, really like Dove. I'm out of Dove right now, so I've been using my Caress. Um, another, like, two other ones I like to use. I like using the body washes from Bath & Body Works. And there's another one that I that I tried, like, a few months ago that I really like. I can't really remember the name of it, but I will insert it, like, somewhere right here, like a picture of it. Excuse my nails, y'all. The Corona got me looking crazy. All the nail sh shops are closed, so I'm stuck with looking like crackheads or whatever. 
And so, in my last video, I don't know if I stated this, but before I go in with my body wash, I like to use bar soap first. Um, I like the dial one. I like using dial and I like using dove. Of course, dove, uh, dial is better because it's an antibacterial soap, so it really just helps to clean all that bacteria and stuff off your skin. Like I said, I work in a medical field. I'm around, you know, stuff 24-7. And, you know, when I'm done, like when I get off in the morning and stuff, I like to really just clean my skin and just get all that stuff off of me. I leave home with nothing. I want to come back home with nothing. I live on myself, but still, like, you want to make sure that you're, like, you want to limit bacteria on your skin so yeah i really like using the dial and i like using the dove dove is a little bit more moisturizing the dial is a little bit more drying but i really really like the dial because like i said it helps to really clean and get all the stuff off your skin and so when i'm out the shower i'm really generic and basic when it comes to my lotion um if when i want something a little bit more not as heavy but i still want my skin to feel moisturized and soft Johnson Johnson, y'all. I love baby lotion. I don't know why, but I love baby lotion. I love the way it smells and everything. It just has like a fresh, clean smell. Like, I just love it. I love, I love, I love this. And then the other two lotions that I really like, I love Nivea. I love Nivea. I swear by Nivea. Been using Nivea for a long time. And recently, since like last year, I've been really liking Jersey's. Jersey's is really thick, it's really creamy. If you got dry skin, it's really good for you. I have combination skin, um, but I really love Jersey's and Nivea because they have, they're really like, it's really thick. It feels like butter. It gets you just feeling good. Your skin is soft and everything. And it, I just, it has like a light fragrance to them. And I really like it because, you know, once you like shower and everything, you're smelling good. You put the lotion on, it just adds to it. It just smells good. So I really like it. And then, of course, for deodorant, I just use Dove. I love Dove deodorant. Real simple. There's nothing much to it. I really like Dove. And then, I do have a few sprays that I like. I have my sprays that I use, and I have my perfumes. Now, when I'm working, um, I don't like to use, like, my good perfumes and stuff when I'm going to work. I just like to put on body spray. If I'm running errands or anything, I'll just put on body spray. After I get out the tub at night or even when I'm done with my little pamper routine and I want to just smell like extra good or, you know, if my man is here and, you know, I just want to like, you know, I just want to smell good. I will put on either Bath and Body Works or Victoria's Secrets. Those are my two favorite like body sprays or body mist. The two that I really like from Bath and Body Works are Mad About You and Cherry Blossom. And I also like Cashmere Glow. I have it tucked away somewhere in my, um, my stash. But yeah, this is... These are the three, those are the three, or these are the three that I really like. Um, they're like the oldest, like these are like, I would say these are like the OG scents. You know, Bath & Body Work, Bath & Body Work comes out with so many different like sprays and scents and stuff, but these are my three, these are my three right here. When they're, whenever they're finished, I go back and I rip on some more. And then with Victoria's Secrets, cause I really like Victoria's Secrets. Of course, Victoria's Secrets is a little bit more heavier and long lasting than Bath and Body Works. So if you like things that are lighter scents and you don't like a scent that is too heavy, Bath and Body Works is the place to go. But if you, you know, if you want like a, a more of a lingering scent and you want more of a stronger scent, Victoria's Secrets. I love Victoria's Secrets. So the two that I have with me right now that's like beside me, cause like I said, everything else is stuck, stuck away in my stash. I do have like a lot of body mist. If y'all want to see like a little body mist collection, let me know down in the comments and I will be more than gladly to um, show you guys my little body mist collection. So I love blush. I love blush. It's one of my favorite sprays. Smells really, really good. And then I have Sheer Love. They both smell really good. These are older scents. Just like Bath and Body Works, Victoria's Secrets come out with new scents year round, all year. They always have new collections and stuff. But these two scents I really like with blush being probably my absolute favorite from them. I do have some from their pink line that I like to wear from time to time or whatever, but it just depends on my mood, where I'm going, and I'll just spray it on. Like, if I don't wanna, if I'm going out, or if I'm running errands, and if I want to, like, really smell good, and I don't wanna put on, if I don't wanna use, like, my uh, my actual perfumes, I'll go Victoria's Secrets, because like I said, they have more of a lingering scent, and they have a stronger smell. Now, 
I love perfumes and I just I've literally just got into like buying perfumes for myself because uh, for the longest I've just been like a body mist girl or whatever but like I said I recently just got into buying perfumes for myself and the two that I'm loving at the time is these two these are my two favorite perfumes so Mark Jacobs Daisy Mark Jacobs Daisy is my probably my hands down favorite perfume when this one is done I will go and give me another one because it smells so good y'all it has like a light it has like a light scent but it's still like lingering like you can spray like two or three sprays on on you or whatever and like it will stay on you all day like people will pass by you and they can and they can smell it that's how strong of a scent it is so it's like light but it's strong at the same time strong at the same time and it's lingering it just smells really good like it just has like a I don't really know how to describe the smell. It has a um what's the word I'm looking for? I don't know, hell. Um It just has like a beautiful like a beautiful light airy smell. It smells like a you just smell like a grown woman. Like you just on your grown woman shit, if that makes sense. And then I got this one as a gift last year for Christmas but it smells really good and it's called Burberry Touch it's crazy because I smell some of their other perfumes and they're a little bit too sweet for my like and I do not like sweet perfumes I like more like colognes not colognes I like more per I like perfumes that are more um I don't know what's the word I'm looking for but I don't like sweet scents I do not like sweet scents when it comes to my perfumes and this one, it just smells really good. You can wear it every day. You can wear it year. Both of these, actually, you can wear both of these year round. I know some people like um, perfumes for the summer. They have like their winter scents and they have like their uh, spring scents. But these two, you can wear year round. They just smell really, really, really good. And this is Burberry Touch. Burberry Touch it smells so good. Matter of fact, let me go ahead and spray some on. It smells so good, y'all. It smells so good. It just has that like it kind of smells like a light cologne I don't know if that makes sense I love the way cologne smells I don't know if that's why I really like this one but it's like a light cologne cologne type smell and it's, it just smells really good <clears throat> and like as far as like you know our menstrual and things like that I usually just wear pads I don't like tampons I used to be a tampon girl but I don't like it stick with pads and I used to always pad I do have them in my bathroom but I'll just insert a picture right here um that's those are the ones that I use that is it for this video you guys I hope you guys enjoyed the video um hopefully you guys got some takeaway pointers it's getting late. I'm tired. I'm ready to take this makeup off. I'm ready to take this wig off. Everything. I'm ready to take a shower and get in the bed. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please do not leave here without liking, commenting, and subscribing to my channel. If you guys have not subscribed to my channel yet and you've been watching my videos, I'm going to need y'all to subscribe. Okay? Help your girl out. Okay? And let me know down in the comments what other type of videos you want to see from me because sometimes I'll be struggling trying to figure out what to film next so just let me know down in the comments what you guys want to see and that is it for the video guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video and i will see you guys next time Mwah.